Hi, I am Ashley Crute, and I am the Director of Internships and MBA Career Services at Longwood University. Um, I have been a member of VASE off and on since 2010. I originally joined as a graduate assistant, as a graduate student, um, stayed, and then I took a brief um, break from career services, so I had to leave VASE for a little while. But um, that is why I was excited to attend the conference in 2022, because that was going to be my first conference back since coming back to career services. Um, so I was already excited to come, um, but I was more excited um, once I received this scholarship because it did take the burden off of my new office. I was an office of two um, with not a very large budget, so the scholarship was super helpful. Um, at the conference, I mean, first it felt like a homecoming, so of course right off the bat, this conference is always so great um, for networking, for reconnecting, for putting faces to names. I think we all email each other a ton and sometimes you just don't have a chance to meet in person. And so that has always been wonderful. And um, last year's conference, I just learned so much. I had had a break from the field. So just it was refreshing to be back with peers. Um, talking with others, bouncing ideas off of each other. I feel like we always come out of the, a session and saying, oh, well, I do this, which is kind of similar to what they talked about. And then these these sessions, um, I feel like end up dovetailing into more and more conversations and in-depth conversations and people emailing each other examples. So you not only leave with what you learned in a session, um, but then you have other colleagues that are sending you supplemental information. So you leave with not just one example, but multiple examples. Um, and this going to the conference right off the bat, um, I brought back to my students, uh, Virginia Intern Day was talked about. I brought back a lot of the NACE information. We were um, in the process of our um, AACSB accreditation. So especially the last speaker was the current president of NACE. Uh, the data that he shared was super helpful. And then also just learning um, about this generation and how to better help my students and how others are helping their students, um, how others are changing their job descriptions, especially their work study positions. Um, we did start to make our positions look more intriguing um, and something that would count for credit. You know, students are looking for internships for credit. So making sure that our job descriptions really reflected something that our students could be proud of. Um, so I would say any conference that you go to, I went to VASE, but any conference you go to, um, to not have the burden um, of paying for it all out of pocket did allow me um, to feel like I could really go and immerse myself and that I wasn't a burden to my office. Um, and it truly, uh, it, it was a, a moment of, um, I guess, less stress. It was less stressful going. Um, and I felt like I could focus more on what I was learning as opposed to like, was this really going to ding the budget? Um, was I not going to be able to do an event for my students because I had to pay for my own professional development? You know, things like that. So I would say um, take a chance, apply for the scholarship, but always just take the chance and go to whatever conference, you know, at the end of the day, um, even if it's just making a new contact or making a new professional friend, um, you just never know what you're going to learn at these things.